Okay. Hopefully, you guys are getting my audio. Let me kind of check on this really fast. Test, test, one, two, three. Hey, let's go. Okay. Second stream in one day. I got a mic this time, unlike last time. Uh, I did a lot of kind of troubleshooting on my channel today where I made a YouTube channel to upload my VODs, which are like the past streams that I've done, so I can keep kind of those. Um, you know, my humble roots. Um, this is a little bit more lag than the last time I streamed. Not terrible, I just gotta get used to it. Um, so just a little bit of explaining now that I have a mic in front of myself. Uh, I started the stream a little bit late last time because I didn't know if I wanted to stream at all, but... You know, my first stream that I tried doing was this game called Control, which I had just been wanting to replay. I'd played it before. Um, but I'm not like a huge fan of the game. And I've just kind of been looking into streams and stuff. And it's always better to just do what you like, you know? You're gonna do it anyway. So, I love Bloodborne. Ow. I'm bad at video games. Um, and I want to replay it anyway. Because it's a new tradition. I want to play this game every Halloween. And yeah, that's kind of the goal. Also, sorry if, like, there's heavy breathing into the mic. I just worked out. And I was also kind of stressing about figuring this whole situation out. For those of you who may already know about Bloodborne, I'm currently trying to be clear. I have, you can see the bot. I already beat the, is the clan beat the first bot? So anyway, new channel news, um, I have a YouTube channel now that I'm going to be uploading those videos to, and I'm going to be streaming more, especially this month, just for this game at least. So the goal is to beat it, not, and it, not the DLC, I, I may try if I like it do really well, if I like beat it way before Halloween, but the, all I'm challenging myself to do is just to be, you know, the final, quote unquote, final boss before Halloween. I like to think I'm okay at this game, but, you know, there's always people who are better than you. And in my case, it's, I'm sure, it's a lot of them. Wow. Really proud of them. I really only have like an hour to stream right now because my wife is out on a walk. Ah! 
Last time I fought this boss, I only had 12 blood vials. Honestly, didn't really make a difference. Oh, crap. I forgot I wanted to buy fire paper. Oh, you know why it's probably laggy? It's because I'm also uploading my past video at the same time. I feel like that's a lot on the internet. I hope the stream's not laggy. Whatever. Do I get the fire paper? I don't even know if I can sell fire, if I can buy fire paper right now. For my family who may be watching, um, this game is a little spoopy, so be aware. Some loud jump stairs every once in a while. Oh wait, what am I doing? I need to freaking summon the hunter. Sorry, I'm thinking of like 500 different things at once. All right, gang. Try this again, huh? So this is a NPC. That is gonna help me fight this boss. And the reason why I fought all these guys instead of running past them is that if I summoned them before, then you'd fight everybody. You know how it goes. But yeah, I linked my YouTube channel to the Twitch channel, so you should be able to find a direct connection there if you ever want to, in the future, look at my old stuff. The only one that's going to be up there is the only VOD I still have, which is the first stream of this game. You really didn't miss much. I, fought, I didn't find any bosses off stream. I think all I really did was get this weapon and maybe a few levels. All right, Henriette. Uh, <laughs> in the early building. Let's get this bread. My echoes. Don't mind. If it gets crazy. experiencing a little bit of lag. I don't know if that's going across stream, so if I die, I will be playing it. What you got, Pump Dog?
pulling her weight right now. Oh my gosh, that's freaking... No, 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 no. That was her healing thing I was trying to tell you about. Baby. Come on, baby. One hit, one hit, one hit, one hit. Oh, too easy. Henriette, you're a gem. Are you gonna hang out? Oh, there you go. Thanks, babes. I don't think this was an optional boss. I know. Cutscene's about to play. Myself really well, fast. I've come to bid you farewell. Oh, I know, I know. You think now to betray me. No, but you will never listen. I tell you, I will not forget our adage. We are born of the blood. Made men by the blood. Undone by the blood. Our eyes are yet to open. Fear the old blood. I must take my leave. Okay, I wanted to check if my mic volume was loud, but the stream was too caught up for me to hear any talking, so... I'm not even going to begin to try to explain this game's story to you. Because I have a pretty good grasp on it. But it's a lot of, like, extra research. And I don't even want to try and mess with that. Okay. I'm going to just test my mic volume again. Oh, I sound really quiet. Test, 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 test. Test, testing, testing, testing. I feel like I'm really quiet as compared to the compared to the game volume. But I don't know how to change that, so we're just gonna roll with the punches. I'm just gonna get my mic real close to my mouth hole, and we're gonna keep on rolling. Welcome home. Actually, hold on. Let me check if I can buy. Fire paper. Okay, I can't even buy fire paper anyway. Okay, so those familiar with Very Bloodborne, well. I'm going to, my, some things I want to do this game are, uh, <laughs> make oh, Dersha my friend, mate. which I know I just, I need to like beat the Bloodstar Beast. At least start the fight with Dark Beast Paul. And then you can like swing around to him. Okay. Good. <clears throat> I also want to complete Eileen the Crow's story, which is 
uh, where I, I, I have never completed that, or I also haven't befriended Jura. Jura. Um, the, player, the part I got to with Eileen is I was trying to help her fight the guy, who, the crazy hunter who you fight in Gascoigne. This is embarrassing. We got my brother. Visceral. That's what it's called. Visceral attack. I don't even know if you can visceral. Vicar Amelia. I really should have just teleported the other way, but we're committed now. Do I have time to switch my actions? Absolutely. Am I? Probably not. We got, 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 we got. I don't need those anymore. Okay, there's a guy hiding right there. Yep. There's a guy hiding right there. I can't get the drop on this guy. Does he see me? Oh, he's on me. Okay, so I gotta kill you pretty fast. Plus, there's this random dog here that drops, for some reason, a ton of blood echoes. Blood echoes, for those uneducated, is what you use to level up your character. I had a ton, and that's why I went to that old place. Wow, this would have been so much faster if I had just gone the other way. So what I'm trying to do right now is there is a NPC, a non-player character, who, uh... She's a lady who gives you nice blood. Healing blood. Is it you? Oh, that might you know the same night. Yes it is. Go oh, there. That may be a peep. <laughs> there you go. So now when I go back to one of my safe zones, there's a lady who gave me a healing item that will continuously heal me. It's pretty good. It's not as good as what I can get later from a different character, but it's good for now. I forgot I locked this guy back here. Oh, okay. Another thing. So you can't see it. This is a little bit spoilers, by the way. So this is if you're side playing Bloodborne or watching Bloodborne, mute it, and I'll uh, I'll move the camera. No, never mind. I'll attack when I'm done with the spoiler. All right. Um, so you can't see it, but there's actually like this crazy, like Cthulhu-looking dude in here, which you actually can't see because you're like in a. So you don't see it until later. Or under very certain circumstances. But he'll try and grab you. That's what that little ball is. Um, if you stand in certain places. And so you can totally get killed by him before you can see him. It's horrifying. I've done it once. I'll never do it again. Hello. Okay. 
this girl here yet. No, because she spawns right here. Alright, we're gonna go back. So that's where I should have spawned. When I kept saying if it would have been faster going the other way, that's where I should have gone. But I didn't think about it. Okay, so the blood echoes are the thing are the thing in the top right, and you come and talk to this little doll to level up. Let's just keep going health. So you're going to see that there's going to be a new person, and it's the girl I just talked to through the door. And she's going to give me some blood. Some juicy blood. I think her name is Adela. Oh, hello, dear. You won't lie. This is a safe place. Thank you. I'm in your debt. I'd like to tender my thanks, but I haven't much to offer. All I can give is my blood. But would you even take a horse blood? Oh. Oh, good. Come close, dear. Don't worry. This isn't the first time. <laughs> Alright, listen. I can explain. Ariana, not Adela. I think Adela is the later one. So it's just like super good healing. It's like healing plus. Where did there this? Heal HP and temporarily boost stamina recovery speed. Oh. Never mind. That's not what I thought. The later one is the one that continuously heals. My wife just texted me about Dream's face reveal tonight. Where do I have the... I'm sending her something. Sorry, give me one second. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. What's next? We are going to go to the forest next, and I'm just... <sighs> Cricket. We're doing it live. What does the gold pen that I just got do again? Forgot about that guy. It was the gold pennant I literally just got. Oh, here we go. Used again a blood gem. Ooh, that's super good. Can my weapon even hold that? No, I can't. Radio. Yeah, no. Because that's not radio. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry for wasting time. Let me kill this guy. Okay, alright, that was rude. We're going to the next zone. If you remember, this is where I got my friend from. I'm just going to run past these guys because I don't want to waste any more time. But yeah, a little bit of backstory about this game. Um, it was my first From Software game. And so From Software, wait, this isn't, no, that's an optional way. Progression this way. From Software are the people who make Dark Souls. And uh, if you don't know what Dark Souls is, it's like a game that people play to be mad. And it's like really hard and you get a sense of accomplishment for beating it. Um, I really like Bloodborne because it's a little bit different than Dark Souls. Dark Souls is a lot of like 
defense, I would say. I honestly don't trust me because I haven't beaten or played more than two hours of a Dark Souls game, but Bloodborne, I've heard, is more aggressive. Okay, so this forest right here is actually horrible. Do I have the monocular? I do. Okay. So there's like the path is like this way and then it kind of curves to the left. There are like gunmen all around. So hopefully I don't die. I don't remember where they all are. Oh no, I'm dead. Wow. Okay. That went about as well as I was going to go. <laughs> what do I do? Molotov? Or do I run through? I mean, it's, it's greedy to want to kill all of them. Okay, I'm just going to do this because I don't want to run through every time. I want to kill them all because more echoes, you know? Oh, what's this? Back in Hunter's a Hunter's Nightmare. Oh, that's an item for a DLC. Um, I'm just going to double check this. I can put it on. Cool. I didn't know that. What is it? It's the same? That does not look the same. I guess. I don't know. I'm glad I checked. Um, so I've... I, I tried Dark Souls 1 for like an hour, and I hated it. And then I tried... I think Dark Souls 3 for an hour, and I hated it less, but I was a huge fan. But then I saw the trailers for Elden Ring, and I was like, that game looks sick, you know, I, it looks really fun, I want to get it. But I was like, Matt, you're poor, don't buy Elden Ring, because you know you don't like Dark Souls, it's bad. And I was like, listen, here's a, here's a, uh, like a challenge to myself. If I play Bloodborne, yeah, I'm sorry, just a second. What? And I like it, then I can get Elf Ring. I actually talked about this a little bit on my podcast, Plug Plug, uh, with uh, my brother in law, David. Oh, on our top 10 favorite games, which Bloodborne made the list. And Bloodborne was free because I had a PlayStation 5, and if you have a PlayStation 5 and their, like, subscription service called PlayStation Plus, you could play it for free. So I was like, alright, that's my chance, that's my in. If you play it and you beat it and you like it, you can get Elden Ring. So I did it. So I downloaded it, played through it, absolutely loved it. This game is a gem and a half. Um, and, okay, let's Molotov. Sorry, I have ADHD and I feel like my brain goes, oh, see, did he, oh, he's on me, he's on me, he's on me. I'm gonna throw it at you. Oh wow, that didn't work, it didn't even kill him, it didn't even kill him. Okay, okay, see, here's... Alright, we're running, we're running, we're running, gang. Okay, you're annoying. This is what I was talking about. Was, uh, whoa! Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. Okay, these glowy eyes means he has my soul, but I can't remember their blood echoes. They're called souls and dark souls. Okay. 
They're not even that much blood echoes, Matt. Just leave. Just leave. It's not worth it. You don't want to die. Matt, you're being dumb. You're being dumb. You're being dumb. You're being dumb. dumb. Alright, certified. I know this is stupid. Doing it anyway. Oh, let's see, okay. That was worth it. That was enough to upgrade my weapon. Now that's enough, right? I can leave. I shouldn't fight these guys. Definitely shouldn't fight these guys. Definitely shouldn't be walking this direction. Oh my gosh. Can I walk up behind all these guys? I would just like everyone to know that that was not worth it. Right? Can we all just establish that? I should have left. Even though it worked out, I made a mistake. There's still one guy, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, there he is. On their own, super easy. Two hits, not a big deal. When there's like seven of them, you saw what happened. You die. Ooh, I was not paying attention. Those dogs are honestly... Yay! I forgot what this area is called, but I like it. It has the easiest boss in this game. The Witch of Hemlock. Hemwick. The Witch of Hemlock. I knew what it was called. I was just correcting myself. Alright, let's go spend these. Also, if there's any audio issues that are in this, I'm going to go back and look at the recording. So hopefully they will be better for future videos. Oh, that's so annoying. 500 more. Not 500 more, gosh dang it. <laughs> Literally, I'm at 500. Welcome, what is very well then. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Fell. Hey, level up my weapon. Wait, do I want to save it for when I get Ludwig's holy blade? Which is going to be my weapon for the rest of the game. I don't remember when I get it. Can I already get it? I might already be able to get it. Hang on. Quick pause. <laughs> Okay, now, you have to beat the Blood Slurp Beast first. Okay, I'm gonna upgrade it then. Cause I'm sure I'll get plenty of twin shards. 
later. Welcome. What? Very well. Sure, you can't hit my boy yet. I think you can hear my sign. But it's also not very loud as compared to Back up. Oh, that. That's better than I currently have. I'm not gonna go back just for that. See, there you go. That's exactly what I need to level up. I'm probably not gonna load it up anymore. Am I even gonna fight the Blood Star Beast? Like, what am I forgetting? That be a doofus. Greedy. That's what happened. I was greedy. Oh, 
What the heck is this? lady over here who's killed me like four times because she just rushes you with her blade. Dog. Oh no, screaming beast. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? No! Yes! Oh my gosh. I can't believe I just saved that. Oh, that was huge. That was huge for me. And. That was close. There's a guy up here I wanna kill. Wheelchair. There he is. Ooh. 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 Who's walking? Okay, we're about to find out. Yep. I know there's no lanterns nearby until the Witch of Hemwick, so I really probably should go back, but I've killed all these dudes. I don't want to. is also horrifying because if you fall off this ledge you die. And there's a dude who's like right there. Can't trick me. Super pretty though, huh? I love like the Victorian Gothic vibe. Those little ghosts or other players, by the way, just playing at the same time. They, we can't help each other. Critter, go away. The cat is all over me. Go away. I'll give you love later. Okay, so up ahead are some scary dudes that I don't love. That's huge. One of them being 
dead as a pig. Oh, get there. Oh no, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna chill out for a second. Right. Hey. We're not as scary as I thought they were gonna be. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Chill. You got trapped in place. You gotta love it. Okay, there's an arcane sigil. Sorry, a lot of this game is like really quick reflexes and it makes it hard to talk. This is what practice is for though, right? Like. Alright, there's a lantern up ahead. I'm pretty sure this is an optional boss, but you get some pretty cool. Oh wait, there's another bad guy up here. place to be in. I don't remember if the... whatever the lamp response before or after the boss. Basically, there's just a little lady who's invisible that I gotta find. She's gonna summon. Oh, there she is. Not by every hit I do, so. But sometimes you get trapped in more than one. It's a bad thing. Oh my gosh. Do I just have to. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 
did you stop summoning guys? This is insane. This is the most, this is the hardest it's ever been. I can't hit her in like the next seven thirty seconds. I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah, alright, this is a bad idea. Not moving while I'm searching for this. Please. Yes. I'm not ready. I'm too weak. I'm just not ready, and that's okay. Call me a coward, I don't care. How do I progress? Welcome. Very well, let me... have to use my freaking blood shards. I have enough to level up again. Oh, I can also check my blood gem. Yep. But I'm gonna want... Let me try again. With my new stuff. Try again. Have I unlocked fire paper yet? No. I can run right into the boss fight, but I don't. There's no way I'm gonna be able to beat the Bloodstar Beast if I can't beat the freaking Lord of Hamlet, right? Hey, Dave. That was my cool podcaster, David. I will throw them up. I don't want 
trigger all the dogs, though. So. Doesn't matter if I run, right? Oh my gosh, apparently it does matter. Apparently it does matter. Wow. That's a fake. Chase me up here. Let's try this again. Even more speedrun style. Huh? Doesn't really matter. It's only eight thousand. What did I do? Where's this dumb lady?
Whoa. 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 This isn't gonna kill me, is it? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I have no idea what is happening. Died or technically, I just ran that one time. So he, there's gonna be a hunter down here. He has something. That's right. The root workshop. This lets me cook the runes, but I don't think I have any good runes yet. My favorite runes are like. Which increases the amount of blood XP you get per kill. Lake does something. Ooh, physical damage reduction. Yes, sir. Bam. 3%. Adds up. Okay. So right now, I'm gonna go get killed welcome, welcome. by a very specific type of enemy. Very well. I need to spend all my junk. <laughs> and the reason why I'm gonna be doing this is so that I can get a better version of this. a man with a bag. Bag man. Man bag. Bag man? Man bag. And what happens is when he kills you, he teleports you to an area that you're not really supposed to be at yet. Since I'm gonna die anyway, and I'm gonna lose my soul, blood, my blood echoes, then I don't want to kill these guys because it's going to be a waste. So I'm just going to run. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, wait. There's also hunters down here that I'm kind of worried about. I totally forgot about these guys. Um. So. Right there is one. And then you can't really look down. But there's another one that's like right down there. Where I need to go is right across this path, and right there is a little bag man that I want to kill me. So, let's see if I can do some sneaking. There's the other one. Let's see. I could also just get like a really good jet on him. Okay, you know what? Wow. Got you. Got 
fight over here so we don't attack that guy. Okay, stop being a little weenie baby boy. Come over here, please. Can you let me heal, please? Can you let me heal, please? Can you, can you come over here, please? Dude, stop trying to attract your friend. I'm not gonna do it. Oh my gosh! Oh gosh, see, they're pretty strong. You uh, can tell. Oh, please. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I just killed that guy. Do I go for the other one? <laughs> Let's do it. This dude is more melee. That other guy was ranged. The worst case scenario is when they both fight you at the same time, but now there's only one of them. I can't believe that that just happened. Now I have like 7,000 pickos. Oh, bull paper, that's huge. Oh, man. Now I want to go spend them. I'm going to go spend them. Because I don't want to lose them. 7,000. That's a lot. What was that? Oh, screen piece! Screen piece! Screen piece! Oh, that's bad. I wonder if I was supposed to fight that guy earlier. And, or those guys, the hunters, earlier, because that gave me, only gave me like level one loot when I'm in a level two loot area. Is there? No, this is the bark. All right, so I'm gonna kill both of these guys then so I can get enough to level up again. Oh, hi, buddy. Avenger bro. Alright, that's enough to level up. So we're doing, we're going back. I gotta make sure to stay on top of the Eileen quest. Another thing that I really love about Bloodborne is I think there's like 30 or like 40 weapons total, which is a lot, you know, but in Dark Souls, it was more of quantity over quality. In this game, it's all about like what the different, oh my gosh, I literally have, I'm gonna have like 12 left over, 16 left over. What are we thinking? What are we thinking, gang? Can't go wrong with vitality. Farewell. Okay. Well, this is, literally sets it up perfectly. For dying. For getting killed. I mean. So the whole reason I'm currently doing this... I already said that. Basically there's... So it's going to teleport me to this prison. And I'm going to break out of my jail cell, but I think literally opening the door. And I'm going to sneak into another jail cell that has like this really scared nun in it. And I'm going to send it to the chapel where the other lady is. And then she's going to give me her blood. She's like, the other lady calls her, the other lady calls herself a whore, which is kind of sad. Um, because 
like this whole economy was based around blood and she like gave it out freely or something or I don't know. Where's Bagman? Bagman? No Bagman? I'm confused. Now I'm just upset. But these guys must pay the price. Oh, there's a screen beast right there. Oh, there's two. Oh, 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 oh. Get there, get there, get there. I don't think I'm gonna get there. But I can try. Get there. No, 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 no. No way I actually got both of them. Anything else possible. Once they, I'm pretty sure once they disappear, they disappear forever. So that was worth it to me. And they were both level 2 materials, so I guess this is a level 2 area. So this area, I'm not supposed to come. Well, I'm, I can come here now, but um, it's not until later. Basically, if you remember earlier, I was telling you that there was like an invisible, visible Cthulhu looking dude. There's also one that's like hanging out right up there. And uh, if you get too close to this door, I'll show you, it'll do the same thing. Look at that. That's him trying to grab you. Pretty spooky stuff. But later, that door opens. You just gotta run past him. So I killed the witch map, like, and now I'm kind of... Where am I supposed to go? Man, I used to have this game down pat. It's been like nine months since I played it. So it's another end of the year. But I want to do a problem for spooky season. Go back to Hemwick, and I'm gonna take a peek around. I'm really sad the Bagman wasn't there. I guess the Bagman doesn't show up until the Bloodstar Beast is dead. Where am I supposed to find the Bloodstar Beast? I remember where he is. It's. I think I. I fight him by going. Welcome. What is it? Farewell, good hunt. Go away. Tell me I'm not gonna have to look this up. Just give me a second to look around. Okay, I got that, which was optional, but pretty important. That's that way. And there's more dudes this way. Uh, excuse me? Oh, 
ही Like uh, those cannons or glass cannons, what I meant to say. Okay, I go that way. I'm gonna have to kill everything in this town. Yeah, this just opens up the key to that one. What am I forgetting? Oh my god. Any time, I'm probably going to so Wait, he's not dead. Oh, oh, oh. Bloodborne. Where to go after Hamlet, huh? Let's look that up. Give myself a little, like, hint, but not necessarily. Does not take hundred years to load. I love that. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I'm stupid. I forgot that it gives you a password. Uh, okay, we're running back this way. When I... So this whole area was optional. Semi-optional, because the thing you got from that hunter that was down those stairs was super important. But you could progress... Um, you learn a password from that cutscene I played after killing the Vicar Amelia boss. The boss I fought before. The Witch of Hemwick. By the way, um, heads up, might stop streaming soon because my wife is back from her walk. You know how it goes with the old life of Rooney. I'll uh, put in the password and I'll call her there. So we're gonna upgrade. to get yeah I know it is the fastest I guess not especially I'm gonna try not to fight it 
guys. Because I just want to run. Oh, this is definitely the fastest way. For sure. I think I might have brought it up earlier. But there's a passcode. Let's see, it's got away. Don't worry about me, dog. 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 Oh, hey! It's my bestie! You're a beast hunter, aren't you? I knew it. That's precisely how I started out. Oh, beg pardon. You may call me Alfred. Protégé of Master Ligarius. Hunter of vile bloods. So, what say you? Our prey might differ, but we are hunters, the both of us. Why not cooperate and discuss the things we've learned? Sure. Oh, very good. Very good indeed. Take this to celebrate our acquaintance. Yeah. Beast hunting is a sacred practice. May the good blood guide your way. May the good blood guide your way. Here it is. This is it. This is the passcode door. <laughs> the password. See yeah, the old one. Nice top hat. <laughs> we have the same one. I can't remember what's down here, but I want to get to a lantern. Is this the same place? I don't remember. Are we already at the snake place? I totally... No, 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 no. Right? I don't think so. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. It's kind of black and Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, scares the crap out of me. Alright, I'm just gonna light this lantern. Open this gate. I don't think I can open the gate yet, actually. I'm gonna kill this crow that I know is right here. Frick you, crow! Light this lantern. Okay. That's what we're gonna call it. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to be uploading this to my YouTube channel, which I just connected, so enjoy that. And uh, have a great rest of your night. This is definitely going to be the last stream for today, so have a good one.